We are currently in Washington, D.C., and this is going to be our day one video. We aren't sure what we will be able to film throughout the day, so instead of doing a bunch of small videos, we're gonna to try to combine it all into one video, show you around. We will keep restaurant reviews on separate videos and maybe some of the museums. It just depends what they allow us to film. But today we're gonna to show you around the Metro. Um, we're gonna to walk to some places, hopefully show you the Washington Monument and the Lincoln Memorial and uh, maybe one of the museums. But if I'm able to film the museum, that'll be another video. So just a day one video here in Washington, D.C. Let's go check it out. We are heading to the Crystal City Metro. So we're leaving the hotel. Gonna cross, cross the road this way and then it should be on up to the right. Listen how windy it is. Unique painting over here for the theater. The metro should just be right on up here. At the corner of 18th Street and Bell Street, we have the Crystal City Station Metro right here, which is what we're gonna get on. Heading down the escalators to the Metro. Down this escalator. Now we have to come over here and get our Metro card, but we just saw a thing that said you can use Apple or Google Wallet to do, oh yeah, save time, add Smart Trip to Apple Wallet today. Well, that's pretty cool. Over here, how to pay, Smart Trip and Apple Wallet and Google Wallet, use cash or credit card to purchase Smart Trip using the vending machine below. Here are some fares they have. So you can purchase multiple cards, single card, pass. And you've got sun, Saturday through Sunday, $2 flat fare. Over here, we do have a map. We're gonna take the yellow to here. And then there should be like a hot dog stand that we're gonna get food at, like right here. And then we're gonna go over here for today. We have our Metro cards. Over here's the metro. This reminds me of overseas when I was in Greece. And those open up. Look at that. So it says it will be here in two minutes. Car eight. And luckily there's like no one down here at the moment. So that works out for us. The lights blink when a train is coming. So. Here it comes. All right, we are on the metro. Now up there it says it is unlawful on a metro station or train to smoke, eat or drink, spit or litter, play a radio or other instrument, carry any animals, or any other dangerous articles. Nice skyline there. Yeah, so total, total time, maybe eight, eight to 10 minutes. Our next stop is Sammy's Hot Dog Cart because Google reviews has it as a five star hot dog cart. So anything that has a five star review with like thousands of views, we have to try. And you do have to scan to get out. Now we go up here and that hot dog cart should be about 300 feet away. 
That is a great picture op right here. There's where we came out of the metro, so we just crossed the road, and this is C Street. So if you turn this way, this is where Sammy's hot dog cart should be, right, right down here. Now the only downfall with a uh, hot dog cart is there's like no seating, um, but right here, Sammy's hot dogs. Yum, ooh, a chili dog on a cold day. That sounds pretty good. Sammy's hot dogs. Pretzels, hot dogs. They do have a lot of chips and other things. Somebody just walked by and said this was great. You can see it says, there's little pictures up there. Welcome to Sammy's hot dog cart. Now you can Google Sammy's, S-A-M-I apostrophe S hot dog cart. You can see the reviews and stuff like that, but um, super excited to try this. Ketchup, banana pepper, and uh, ketchup and some relish. She will take one with just ketchup and mustard, please. Ketchup and mustard? Yes. And then we've got a drink and two chips here. What would you recommend? How do you get yours? Chili cheese. Okay. That's it? And let everybody smell it. I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> let everybody take a bite. Okay, we'll do that. <laughs> Chili cheese sounds great. Yeah, that smells good. He said the chili and cheese is his famous one. And just on down from it, so there it is over there. Here are some tables and then some chairs. But he said this is his famous one, so I'm excited to try it. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but he's been doing that for 34 years. 34 years. There's one with relish on it. Oh, and those oh. have banana peppers. That is very good. And he also gave us all mints. That is really good, especially on a cold day. Total price for four bags of chips, four hot dogs and two drinks, 36 bucks. Yeah, give Sammy's a thumbs up. That was a really good hot dog place. Now we're gonna head back to the Metro. We're gonna go to the Smithsonian Museum of American History. That one I think we're gonna make a separate video of. I think you can film in there. I think we'll put a pause on the video for now because we're just gonna do the Metro made it over to the Smithsonian Metro. Perfect, perfect deal with that uh, Metro because now you're right out here. Right next to them. Not sure if you can hear me because of how windy it is. It is very, very windy. But this is an awesome view. So there's the Museum of Natural History. Over here's the Museum of American History. Washington Monument. We're going to attempt to go into the Museum of American History first and try to film that. Here we have the Smithsonian National Museum of American History. Here we have it. Look at all these flags. The entrance is up here. Nice thing about all these museums, they are free and you actually do not need a reservation for them. You just show up. When you look online, it says you could spend up to three hours easily here. So we'll kind of time it and see how long we spend here. We just finished up at the National Museum of American History. So now we're gonna head toward the monuments. You can see it's still very windy out. This is gonna be a very brisk, fast walk to see these monuments. Here is that monument. Another Smithsonian Museum. Oh, this is the National Museum of African American History and Culture. Now you can rent scooters and bikes. Just listen to the wind. <laughs> oh, this is the coldest I have been in a long time. haven't been this cold in a long time. That's why we live in Florida. Look at the wind just go. It is pretty cool to see the Capitol building right there. Wow. That's 
big. The Washington Monument is closed due to unsafe weather. At least we can go up and say we've touched the Washington Monument. This video might be trashed by now with the way the wind's blowing, but if you can hear me, we're heading down there to the Lincoln Memorial. And right over here, we have the back side of the White House. There you have it, pretty cool. Look at the water just, oh my goodness. This is crazy. All right, that's all we're getting to that. <laughs> this is really cool. Hey, Florida. There we go. Wish it was as warm here as it is in Florida. Here we have the reflecting pool. Cleaning in progress. Reminds me of Forrest Gump. Pretty cool though, you could, oh, you can see the Lincoln Memorial. And then this way, Washington Monument. <laughs> hey. I'm crying. calm down just for a second so now we can actually talk but heading to Lincoln Memorial here it's too bad they're cleaning the pool here because it'd be nice to see it filled but we'll just come back some other time that's cool here we have restrooms park store this way huh here is what it looks like there's quite a bit of people they are doing a little bit of construction on it right now these are some, these are some stairs. And here we have it. Four score and seven years ago. And here is the view from the Lincoln Memorial. So I just heard somebody say the water is gone right here because they just had ice skating. They had people who, uh, they made ice skating for people. So that's why the water's not there. Current temperature, it feels like 37 degrees. We're gonna head towards this uh, park store this way. Oh, over there. Over here, we do have refreshments and gifts, and then restrooms and park store. And this park store is open 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. Oh, what do they have? Stamps. Oh, they have stamps. Passport stamps. Nice. But we didn't bring our book. No, we didn't bring our book, did we? So then we stamp and then. We're going to get our national parks stamps. There's a lot of them. So we're gonna go to the Korean War Memorial here and then the Vietnam War Memorial. Wow. Here's the Vietnam War Memorial. Here 
with all the names. Again, so sad. Let's see how tall this actually is. There's my height to it. Reservation at the Hamilton tonight at 7, which is about an hour and a half from now. That will be a separate video. I think we're just going to kind of walk and maybe find some shops or something to hop into for now because it is still just freezing cold. As I say that, there's some in shorts running. We're pretty close to the White House, but here we have Constitution Hall, Department of the Interior. Now, Timber just reminded us that Constitution Hall, they did some Jeopardy episodes there and we've seen them we've watched a couple of those episodes and then something else i've been thinking of while we're down here is national treasure what a great movie that is some of the places were filmed down here check out the trees yeah this is very pretty we're a little early they're it's supposed to be blooming i think at the end of the month but Still very pretty. This is Rollins. Look at this building. Wow. I looked on the map and it says Eisenhower Executive Office Building. Here we have the White House this way and the famous Pennsylvania Avenue. A little information about that building. Here we have the White House massive fence out in front this is pretty cool look at this one of these days we're going to try to get in for a tour but we weren't able to this time wow that is cool yeah that is really cool that's awesome really cool just another view of it on this side. Right here we have the Treasury Department. The winds finally calmed down a little bit. Whew. That's pretty cool, they got a mobile tour. Now right across the street is the White House gift store. That's a nice building there, that's really cool. Yeah, we'll go in, we'll go in here. Here we have White House gifts. Cool. So they've got t-shirts, probably some stickers. They've got hats, shot glasses, bobbleheads. Right, this is a good store. Books. We have found the stickers. Here we have the Hotel Washington. And as we take a left, walk down this way. Oh, there, we can see the Hamiltons right on up here. We just uh, finished up at the Hamilton and it is freezing cold. Look at the wind. It says it feels like 30 degrees right now. And we are heading back to the Metro to go back to the hotel. Now, one of many reasons we moved to Florida was to get away from the freezing cold like this. This is the coldest I've been in a long time. The camera's probably shaking. That's my hand shaking from freezing. I think we're gonna end the day one video here. It's freezing cold. All we're doing is going back to the room. Don't know how much of the video you were able to hear. By now you'll know, but it was very windy. Coldest I've been in a long time. But it was really cool to see everything. Yeah, we'll have to maybe take another trip out there to see if we're not miserable. Yeah, definitely like seeing the White House. That was really cool. Um, seeing the Museum of American History was good. We are very tired. I like the monuments. Monuments, yeah. And like the memorial. Yeah, the Lincoln Memorial was really cool. Um, all of them, all of it was great. I definitely think everybody in their life should come out at least once and check out Washington, D.C. Cold and tired right now, so we're gonna end the video here on the Metro. With that being said, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.